And with the cold temperatures tonight, we do have our first and hopefully last freeze warning for the spring. Austin Cheney explains why we don't see these freeze warnings all winter long. All right, so we do have a freeze warning in effect for tonight for these purple shaded counties, and that seems pretty intuitive, right? Temperatures are going to be near freezing in these areas, but have you ever wondered why we don't see these freeze warnings and frost advisories year round? Well, check this out. They're actually not issued during winter time when freezing temperatures are most likely. They're only issued during the start of the growing season and the end of the growing season. So we're talking about early springtime and late fall where there's the potential for any sensitive plants to be damaged by a frost or a freeze. So instead of really alerting everybody to the fact that we could have some cold weather, it mainly alerts those growers, farmers, everybody that may have some plants in the ground that they just might want to protect those plants. So if you're one of the early folks like myself that actually has some plants in the ground or in some pots, you may want to bring those in tonight or cover them to protect them for any uh, freezing temperatures that we may see this evening. Now here's the good news. We may be turning the corner on winter time. The latest six to 10 day outlook from the Climate Prediction Center does show above average temperatures here and over much of the country. So hopefully this is the last little brush with winter weather that we see for the spring of 2021.